day, I have set myself the challenge to earn as much money as I can PKing, starting only with a Darak set. This is a little different to other from scratches where people start with just one item. They can always protect item and keep it if they die. I don't have that luxury. Once I skull up on someone, I'm risking three quarters of the set. If I die, this challenge is over. With Darak's, the lower your hit points, the higher you can hit. So I need to try and find the right balance between being low enough to hit big and kill people, but not too low so I just die straight away when they hit me back. First few kills are going to be the hardest. I have no food or potions, I need to find someone who's not going to fight back and just do my best to take them out. I think the best spot for this might be dark crabs. Most people come here just to AFK fish, they won't risk a lot, also probably won't try too hard to defend themselves. Okay, hop for a few worlds and I finally found someone, I just need to lower my hit points a bit first so I have a better chance of killing them. Alright, that's probably enough, I just hope this guy doesn't turn around and kill me. Oh yes, it's someone without armor, this is perfect. Oh, he's running the gate. No, he's going to get gap from this and escape. I'll chase him and see if we can get him, but I think he's gone there. Oh, we've got, we're caught up. Okay, good. He still might make it away. He's going to Mage Bank. I don't know why he's not going to use the worldy lever, but... What is he doing? He's gone the wrong way. He could have escaped, but he just missed the webs. All right, it was a great start. Spoiled in the chat, let's turn it off. But we do have 70k to play with now. Right, geared up and ready to go. Just need to change to normal spellbook. Got some entangles, got some tally blocks, but I'm gonna still need to try and get a couple more people who are not gonna fight back so we can get some proper gear. Just realizing that I probably should have brought a stamina potion and maybe an anti. But we'll remember that next time. Found another person, but it's an Australian world. This might be difficult. Just need to lower my health a bit. All right, let's see how this goes with actual gear now. He's not praying. <laughs> he's just laughing, but he's dead. Another one down. Let's get another couple of these before we leave here. This guy's got an Ellie and everything. I'm not killing this guy. And that is a fact. He's got gear to tank. Oh, two people to choose from. Get level 75 actually. It's all Iron Man. He's a clue scroller, he might have money. Right, three keys are good enough. Let's see what we've got. How good will the loot be? Actually, not too bad. Decent amount of cash and crabs. 74k. 99k. Get some entangled sacks and stuff. And final guy, 50k into Marine Arrows. That will do. We can get some nice gear upgrades with that. Right. I think I'm just about ready to kill some proper PVMers now. Got a range switch. 
got the DH. Let's try out the Slayer Cave and hope I don't get killed by a multi-team. Okay, found a word with cannon. And I get a TB on him. Oh, I'll have to be fast here. Right, second chance, here we go. Ooh, there's someone at Anku's. They'd be expecting this. Oh, my health isn't low at all. Yes, maybe you can help me. If he gets my health low, I can kill him. Oh my god, I chose the worst time. Hopefully he can't escape from that. He looks to be struggling. Yeah, he's not got time. He slowed me enough. If he goes for the freeze, he could just get me. I oh, will risk it. We're just going to stick in DH. <laughs> he gets two levels down, he wins. I've just got to... There we go. How much was he risking? 189k. That's actually not too bad. Now rocking the Mystic Hat and Barrow's Gloves. And I've actually got Staminas. So we can run around a bit. Oh, we found someone, but he could quite easily kill me with his up. Oh, 58. I can't see if he's got like a spec weapon or anything either. <laughs> he's got the bend. So, if he goes out now, he wins. He's just run. He's run. He's, he's escaped me. No. He's got the log out. Ah, oh, he could have killed me with vengeance. He's not logged out. Oh, he did log out. He logged out and back in. Oh, he's just mucked up. Oh, he's not. Risked it. He's got to have some decent loot. He's using the scepter, so he got Rev Effer from him. 
Let's go straight to Edgeville. I'm thinking at least 200, 300k from this guy. <laughs> One mil got this occult! Oh, shit. Right, we're gonna have a bankload of gear after this. Well, I am quickly running out of invent space. We've now got a Tome of Fire. Ring of Shadows. Uh, what are we risking currently? Killed by a player. 4 mil, so we've made about 1.3 mil so far. Not too bad. Let's go try and kill some more people. I <laughs> just didn't eat. That's <laughs> like that freest kill I've ever seen. Oh my god. He's gonna have to run a long way. Unless I just muck up. I think it was Australian world. Everything is everywhere. Alright, if he lowers me a bit, it's probably probably good. Oh no no! I've mucked up. Go on, land the entangle. Got it. Why is he out down to me? Got him. <laughs> GG. Another Ryan Man dead. What will the loot of these two keys be? Oh shit! Like 1.5 mil between these. 800k of loot. I'm gonna need to go sell. This guy. Yeah. Revs. 1.5 mil in like two minutes. Upgraded the staff. Now it's back to revs. This guy's just anti pecan it's not worth trying to get. He's got the Venge AGS, he's not trying to kill revs. Did I just die to a recoil? Well, um, yeah, like the video if you want to see me do this again. Robert has died for 5.5 mil, so we were doing all right.